Hello folks, let's just dive right in. This boss is resistance to Geo, but everything else works fine. It has two achievements that we can get in one single run, and the unique thing is the gravity phase. During this phase, everyone can do super jumps like Xiao, and you can disable it by hitting the boss three times with Numa attacks, but this phase is fun so I don't want to cancel it early anyways. This boss actually dies pretty quickly, I just hope they don't beef up the HP in the Spiral Abyss. Let's start with the two achievements. The first one is to land 11 plunge attacks during low gravity. And the second is to not get hit by the huge quake attack. Getting hit by other stuff is fine, like this projectile here, you can get hit by that and still get the achievement. And you can also get hit by these smaller eruptions and it doesn't nullify the achievement either. Just avoid the big huge slam that the boss does twice per gravity phase. On to the attacks. First off, the spin laser. The lasers start off in the middle, then spread out, so the safe spot is actually right under the boss. When the lasers converge at the end, you want to dash out a little to avoid the beams and then continue attacking. The quick slam is just that. It goes in the air and quickly slams down. Dash away to avoid. The missile attack has a little tracking, but the tracking's not that strong so you can run or dash in a straight line to avoid it. On to the attacks from the low gravity phase. You can stop this phase by hitting it with 3 Numa attacks, but I think it's more fun to fight inside this phase. The first attack it always does after switching are these quick slams. Use your super jump and then glide if you jump too early, or use a plunge attack to stall in the air a little bit to avoid the quakes. The first time, the boss will use 3 slams, and then the second time, it will use 2 slams, followed by 3 really quick ones at the end. Make sure to glide on the last set of slams, so you can avoid getting hit by the quakes and get the achievement. Grand Slam it's just another slam, but with an AoE indicator on the ground. Eruptions. The boss casts a lot of small eruptions under your feet. They blow up when it grows to max size, and they're pretty easy to dodge. Just dash when you see one underneath. Finally, Rock Throw. It'll sling a bunch of projectiles at you, so you, you want to keep running to avoid them, and these hurt a lot. Getting hit by a single one did 7500 damage to my tanky Bennett. And that's all the attacks. This boss is actually pretty weak, and I killed it in 20 seconds. Anyway, hope this helps, thanks for watching, and as always, have fun out there traveler.